Well, that's right. You know, British American Tobacco, they sold stake in IDC this morning and they've raised close to $2.1 billion. And this is the third instance of a foreign holder selling stake after the promoters of Timkin as well as Whirlpool, they stole, sold their stake earlier. But if the Indian markets are so well placed, then why are these foreign holders selling their stakes? Well, a couple of reasons. Renowned investor Sunil Sagania, he explains it perfectly in a tweet that he put out. He points out that BAT is trading at valuations which are far lower than ITC, in which it holds stake. While Whirlpool CEO Mark Bitzer, he defined it as an asset arbitrage, as the parent is trading at mid-single-digit PE, but the Indian listed subsidiary is trading at around 40 to 50 times its earnings. Now, all the three entities, they are cashing in in the Indian market, but they're looking at bettering their capital allocation at the global listed firm level. Timken as well as BAT, they've already announced buybacks, while BAT and Whirlpool, they have said that they're looking to deleverage their books and looking at some debt reduction as well.